didn't say this, but in his mind, I bet he was like, bitch, why the fuck your eyes open? You're supposed to close your eyes. When you're watching a movie, what the fuck is wrong with you? I am back. I know I have been, ooh, it's a wing, so you know, we gotta flip this. So anyway, um, I know I have been away. I don't have long hair. So anyway, I know I have been I have been MIA for a while now, but you guys I just have I, I had to go to school, I had to go back to school, um shopping and everything, paying school fees here and there, so it was kinda of hectic and I have regular at <laughs> crosses. Oh it's Jesus Christ. I have regular regular <laughs> classes from like before eight to around four in the evening, four thirty or five five ish. So anyway, I'm back. Who missed me? Yeah, she really stopped that stupid dance. Anyway, so let me tell you a story. Me, okay. <laughs> yeah, laughing at my own jokes again. One boy really, really. We're going there right now. So anyway, me like class. Me like class. Uh, my new lecture. I'm excited. Apart from my forex course, I'm doing another course. Anyway, so the story is, no, I'm just there. Me, I'm just, uh, uh, I sit at the back, but not really at the back. Like, I'm not at So, um, I love you. Okay. Are girls allowed to say no homo? Because, uh, okay. I'm about to say, um, <sighs> so, um, I love you. And she's fine and whatever. Then, which are class and everything we're talking about follicles hair growth and yeah which come as well so like three minutes in the lesson she three minutes in the lesson which are like kind of lectures they dictate notes i don't know about other countries but as we try to put on our notes yeah and i'm doing this because <laughs> it's obvious <laughs> so uh and then go to dictate your notes hey will you mean so <laughs> so um, she's just there then, but see, I, I told you guys I was talking about her. So she's saying that, Anangoa, she said Shari, and I'm like, Shari? Really? And I'm the one who's over there who's dying. Me ni coaching her, look at and the other chicks look at me like, not chicks, because mostly our, cla our class has chicks. The girls look at me like, it's not even that funny, bitch, it's not even that funny. And I'm like, so y'all don't got a sense of humor? And I'm stuck with y'all like for four semesters, really. And that was funny. That, that shit was funny. Y'all didn't get it? You didn't? Okay. Fine. Yeah. Because yeah, because I have to continue this video. So uh so I'm back and excuse me. So, uh, uh, I have been watching a lot of story time videos and I thought it would be fun to do a story time video. So, I went to shout out to some of the YouTube channels I watched, which, and the best one was actually Wahura, yeah, and East meets West, so yeah. So, I decided, let me tell you a story, because I think my life is pretty interesting. Yes. I want to tell you guys about my first story. Wow. My neighbors are playing that music like what the fuck just when i'm recording wow wow i know you clicked on this video because you wanted to know who lied yeah so this is a story uh i'm telling you guys about my first case and it is very embarrassing especially for me so uh this was like way back in when i was in form three right i was in form three transitioning to form four so uh you know the, we, we girls talk a lot so when class people are talking about their first kiss and whatever their boyfriends their mans and i'm just saying like uh i thought we were supposed to get boyfriends when we got in college or university so why 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 do you guys have men in your life like why the hurry like because first of all dating in high school was stress because it was just too much work for me, especially for me. I am I'm, I'm not okay, I wouldn't say I'm lazy, but you have to write letters. Yeah, you have to stamps. 
then you get someone to colleague for you and obviously you pay them you then you have to find like this very colorful writing pad so see you guys can relate to that and then you have to buy those from someone it's just too much work for more so i didn't date till i was like after from four rather because it was just too much work so anyway so people are talking about their first uh, like their boyfriends and everything and I mean, I'm, I'm just there I mean, I'm just floating floating so um, About the first kiss and everything about where, where, they, where they went gym walls dreams you are gaki gaki so anyway We get to the holiday and I decide you know what? I don't want to have like a boyfriend boyfriend. I just want to have experience like I just want to have my first kiss so anyway back then <laughs> let me tell you guys I was raised by my by my aunts and my uncles because of some reasons so they they were very strict they were very very strict so like majo asa kwenda kwa shop ilikuwa shida like kwenda kutoka and i'm going like mm mm-hmm. where the fuck you go and like they just looking at you like unaendas so nile unaenda ndio kwetu kwa nyumba kwetu kwa nyumba na api when you going you're 16 where do you see what do 16 year olds do they uh, they have bad influence towards each other they will tell you to do stuff so my parents was like nah no like every time i wanted to go they were like no ka kwa nyumba unasikia so anyway so uh this is what happened i was like you know what i'm doing this shit i have to know what happens like i'm just curious i'm 16 and i'm stupid and curious so what what do i do uh yes my parents were religious and strict and everything but when he, when he was about going to church and having a church week they were they were just easy so kuliko na church week and i have a friend of mine I will call her Pen. So Pen was very pretty. She was light skin. Then she was paying then no homo. She had this hourglass figure. She was light skin. She knew how to draw her eyebrows and whatever, eyeliner. I didn't know shit. I didn't know. We were in church school that week for an entire week because we had I think we had a competition for church and everything. So so see, I told my aunt I would, I would I would I wanted to go because I just wanted to get out of the house. It's like a normal 16 year old would do. So anyway, and it was church school and Pen would come every day. So Pen came with this other guy. Oh my god, he was hot as hell. As hell. Wow, I just had to compare someone that looks with hell. Okay, that is just so inappropriate. But anyway, so he was hot and he was light skinned and he was tall. You know, um, what did we used to call it? We used to call it at the American high time and your basketball. Let us dream. So this guy, he was fly, he was light skinned, he was tall. Those were all the items in my bucket list when I was 16. Yeah, I know, very shallow, I know. But I was 16, so whatever. So this guy. So Pen introduces, introduces me to this guy, and this guy we call him um what do we call him Bread. So I'm like, oh my god, you're so cute, but I didn't say it because I didn't want to act desperate. So he was cute. He was tall. Then he had tattoos all over his arms, his chest. Okay, because he used to wear vests. Not that I was, you know. So I was like, so hey guys, I'm back. Yeah. Yesterday my phone was bitching and everything so I had to stop recording and start reading for my exams because I have cuts next week. Anyway, enough blabbering. So, yeah, and with the story. May God please bless me with a camera. Amen. Okay. So, as, as I was saying, which part of the story was I? I think I was telling you guys. Oh, so, Brad invites me to the place and I had forgotten and I was from the shower. Then this girl of yours, what does she even wear? I wore shorts and I forgot to oil myself. Can you believe I forgot to oil myself? Then I remember the previous night, you know the way that like, you panga furniture in your house then, okay, or where you live if you live with the parents, where you, when you arrange your furniture, then you just bump into something and you get hit. So my biggest toe, my cutest toe, the biggest one, my toe, it it sent on the ilikatika nusu nusu so when ilikatika ikabidi nitoe nitoe tu yote cuz man's there was just no need of insisting with a broken nail so i removed it so hey first of all i forget to oil myself then i wear shorts and i wear a t-shirt and this guy 
I go to their place, I walk to their place because their place was like behind our, our house. So as I am going to their place, I ring the doorbell like once or twice. Then this guy for some reason, who, yeah, bread for some reason, does not even open the door. I'm like, what the fuck? What the actual fuck is happening? So I get pissed and I go home. Then as I get to the house, he texts me and he's like, yo, where are you at? I'm like, I came. I knocked you didn't fucking open the gate so was there any need to stick around i didn't think so so i'm not coming and if you want me to come you, come, you better come and pick me up or else i'm not coming to your house so uh he comes picks me up then we go to the house then I was wearing this blue i had this blue doll shoes okay see I, that was my favorite pair so i go to their place me we go we sit down then as we sit down hey jesus christ this guy for some reason just starts staring at my toes then i remember oh lord i didn't apply polish then my feet were ashy because i didn't oil myself like it was so embarrassing so embarrassing then i was a disaster like i'm freaking out i'm sweating i'm embarrassed it was just it was just too much to deal with yani wondering like wa aki leo ni ile siku yani ile siku ya kuibika yani ile proper so anyway uh he asked me like what do you want to drink i say coke so he goes in the kitchen and gets me a coke then as we are sitting down okay i make a isi yangu right due to make a their couch and everything so i uh, had this dude like ananza kunsongia so i'm like is this really happening today? I'm like, uh, I'm freaking out. I'm sweating. You guys, that was just a very embarrassing day. Then he just stands me like, and I'm like, okay, you you didn't have to be that rough. Like, I get the gist. So anyway, he turns me then. <laughs> you know, I'm expecting like the Prince Charming Cinderella kisses we see on TV, the, but nah, nah. That was not what happened. So here's what happened. His lips are on mine. And I'm like, okay, what am I supposed to do right now? Uh, how does this work? Because I never kissed nobody except him. Okay, so I, I, I didn't know how to do it. So, and okay, you know, we watch like soap operas and everything. And you're like, at least you can get shit. Me, me, si kwanarada shit. Si kwanarada anything. Yani. Wow. So his lips are on mine, right? I feel his tongue, then I feel his teeth. I'm like, is this supposed? Okay, am I supposed to feel your teeth? But I, I don't know. Then I just close my eyes. Then I open one eye. Then I'm just staring at him, and he's he just opened he's just opened his eyes like, and he's just looking at me because I'm looking at him, and he's like, he okay, he didn't say this, but in his mind, I bet he was like, bitch. Why the fuck your eyes open? You're supposed to close your eyes. When you're watching a movie, what the fuck is wrong with you? Can you close your damn eyes? And I'm like, okay. But in my head, I just like told my, my myself, like, you know what, close your eyes. But because he was looking at me like, I don't even know how. I don't even know how. I sound sad. I sound come out to every TV. I take all myself. Anyway. So uh, that kiss was over, and it, as okay, immediately it immediately it was over. The door flies open, and I'm like, oh my god, his parents are like, Kuja, I'm I'm about to get busted. I'm about to be in shit. Luckily, it was his brother. Then he was he, when he walked in, he was like, oh, okay, am I interrupting something? Then we were like, nah, 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 you're not interrupting anything. So he left. Before he left, he said, unajua kwenye zangu ziko. Like what the fuck? I'm not about to get my first kiss on the same day and get pregnant. Like nah. So as soon as his brother walks out, like five minutes later, uh Brett goes to the kitchen to go get something. So I'm like, <laughs> this is my opportunity. Girl, you gotta go. Yani, you have to leave. Yani, you can't get your first kiss on the same day and get pregnant. Like, no. Because okay, I overthink. So what do I do? As soon as he walks in the kitchen, <laughs> your girl, I'm a mean yani left my friend then as soon as i am leaving guess why he guess we bump into i put on a put on a best auntie angle like before work or something you know when you like more they just hang out together so there's this friend of hers let's call her 
let's call her Irene. So I meet Irene on the road, and she's like, "Kwanu zawa viatu." Nili, asa nisi, mojo wongo. You know, just those kind of lies. Me, I just tell her, "Nili kwa ni mnyia buke chemistry." Then nika sahau. Then like that was just a lie, you know. Ile ni onyeka na yani tumi wongo. You just trying to structure lies because I'm in yona. Sina viatu, and I am running from some boy's house. So. Next thing I know, ni menda nyumbani, at least I'm at peace. But I was still freaking out because I knew she was going to tell my aunt. So, as soon as I get to the house, <laughs> uh, I turn on the radio, I wash my feet, I oil my feet, finally. 3,000 years later, na jipaka mofta mugu yote, mofta ni mwoga miku, ni then na washa radio. Guess what? Guess what I hear on the radio? This guy previously, okay, flashback to when we were in church. He, okay, we, we, okay, it was Jikama Likotenyam, uh, Likotenyam Kurihas something. So me and him had to look at the church. Then Akanyambia, let, let me sing you, let me sing you a song. Then he told me that he composed it himself, and I was like, oh, I'm so impressed. You sang for me, I was so impressed. So anyway, that okay, that Saturday, as I after I knew I watched the radio. <laughs> I hear the song he apparently wrote for me, and I'm like, oh my god, what the fuck though? I'm about to get my ass whooped over a boy who lied. So I was punished by my aunt because obviously the friend did tell on me, on me. So yeah, I got punished. I was disappointed because he lied. Oh, but I didn't see him after that because we moved, and I'm so happy that we moved. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. I didn't have to see his lying ass again. Okay, but he did just lie about the song, nothing else. Yes, but I was still salty. So yeah, we moved. Yes, we moved, and I didn't see him after that. I didn't even he didn't even come to church after after that. Actually, I didn't come up to church. So I like saw him after a year, yeah, like a whole year. But then I was looking here. I was looking pang. So I was was feeling expensive. So I, I didn't even say hi. It was just like to up today. We don't talk. Yeah, but I'm not salty. But I just wished he didn't lie. So anyway, thank you guys for watching. And if you liked this video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, give it a thumbs up. Anyway, just be nice. And oh, stay fabulous. Stay fierce. I love you. Bye. I get both your mans, where they went, where they were taken. But most letters will go to one for you guys. What work class you too? It was lies, I know. It was lies. So completely unrelated to this video, I just wanted to make a, a, a quick shout out. The first one goes to my friend Kyle, who got me a very nice car gadget. Yeah, so he knows what he got me. It's blue and it's silver. So thank you, Kyle. Uh, the second one goes to my best friend. He's called Nixon, Nixon Jiroge. He has um, at Noob Creations. Yeah, if you want any graphics done, do holler at a boy. Yeah, I will insert his direct link of his Instagram so if you can check out some of his work. Yeah, and the last one goes to my other best friend. Yes, I have two best friends. My other best friend, Romeo, he has, uh, he dropped a single last December. It's called Black Santa. Do check it out. It's a dope song and I'm not suggesting that because he's my best friend because it's good work. So I will leave his description or his link, sorry, yeah, in my description box, so do check them out. And I have some other amazing videos that you guys should check out on my channel. Yeah, so thank you and bye.